Forza Motorsport has a long history of creating some beautiful and seriously challenging fictional tracks in their titles. From the Bernese Alps to the all-new Hakone Circuit, the developers are always out to one-up themselves with new and exciting racetracks. Forza Motorsport 2023 released and the community had finally got what they had been waiting for for six very long years. But there was one very noticeable fantasy track missing, Fujimi Kaido. The game released with 20 tracks at launch and a promise of more to come in the upcoming updates. But that didn't sit well with a lot of the community, especially those who were excited of the possibility of getting our beloved Fujimi Kaido back. What if I were to tell you though, we already have Fujimi Kaido in the game today and we just don't realize it. Well, I'm here to tell you, that's likely the case. Don't go anywhere, this is gonna be good. What's going on everyone, I am Connor Speed 6 and yes, today we are going to be taking a deep dive into the speculation of Hakone being a part of Fujimi Kaido once the track is introduced in Forza Motorsport. But before I get into the meat and potatoes of today's video, I want to thank one of my longest subscribers and supporters, Pro7Gaming, for helping me with some information in today's video. She dropped into my Discord with some of this info and speculation began flying. Another massive thank you to Hoki Hoshi for the footage from Fujimi Kaido you are seeing in the video. He took time out of his life to record a full run on the Mountain Pass circuit for us, and I am very much appreciative. Much love, Hoki and Pro7 Gaming. Thank you all so much. Alright, now for the good stuff. Hakone is an all-new fantasy track that was introduced by Forza Motorsport on September 21st, and the community went bananas in the YouTube track reveal video comments. It looked to be a fast, flowing track with a gorgeous backdrop of Hakone Japan and Mount Fuji in the distance. Hakone, in real life, sits between Sagami Bay to the east and Mount Fuji to the west in Japan's Fuji Hakone Itsu National Park. In the game, the track sits on the beautiful coastline of Lake Ashi, which you can see to the left of the main strait when racing the normal circuit layout. Now, we all know that Fujimi Kaido is likely coming to Forza Motorsport. The big question though is, when? We don't know that for sure, but what I can tell you at this point is that it's very likely going to be coming soon and will undoubtedly be connected to Hakone Circuit. Let's talk about why I believe this for a moment. Hakone Circuit, if you look at it, has two very distinguishable roads that connect to the track. Looking at this track map art from the loading screen, you can see the road leaving the circuit at the end of the start finish straight here. And another road that reconnects to the circuit on the back straight shown here. Now, looking at these two roads at ground level, you can tell these roads were definitely not put there for decoration. The road from the main straight is blocked off by barriers and has a safety truck and an ambulance as well as some tents blocking the road. Of course, we can't get a real clear view of what the road looks like or where it goes, but it looks as if the road continues up the lakeside and into the surrounding mountains heading out towards Mount Fuji. Taking a look at the road connecting to the back straight, we can see that once again it's blocked by barriers and some pro rata signs. But looking in between the signs and around the barriers, we can see a clear picture of a racing track. One with a long banked curve and some rumble strips on the inside of the corner. Now why on earth would developers put that much detail into a road that's never going to be driven on? They wouldn't. It's a simple easter egg that leads me to believe that the all new Fujimi Kaido layout will include a large portion of Hakone Circuit at the bottom of the mountain before shooting you back up into the mountains to finish a massive lap around the Fujimi Kaido Mountain Pass. Think of it as the Nordschleife of Japan in Forza Motorsport 2023. How epic is that going to be if that happens? Now, please remember, this video is purely speculation. But while we are just speculating, it's all based on the fact that we know Kaido is coming back and the evidence of the connecting roads at Hakone, along with the close proximity of Fujimi Kaido and Hakone Circuit. Now, when I'm talking about the proximity of the two locations, we have to remember that both of these tracks 
they're not real. And they're not real places, technically. That being said, if you were to compare their fictional locations in-game to their real-world locations, they are extremely close to each other. And this is not a far stretch at all. Hakone is uh, about a two and a half hour drive from Fujimi in Nagano, Japan, which is exactly where Fujimi Kaido is located based on the track's information from past titles and from the Forza Wiki. For me, this would be an absolute game changer for Forza Motorsport and its community. To be real, we absolutely need this to happen, and if it doesn't happen after all this speculation, I will be beyond disappointed. Now tell me, what are your thoughts on the possibility of this happening? Do you think it will happen? Do you think it won't happen? Also, what are your overall thoughts on the game? It's been out for a little while and I just want to know your true take. Weird bugs and crashes aside, what are your honest thoughts of the gameplay as well as the multiplayer layout? I'd love to hear your thoughts. Again, I want to give a huge thank you to Pro7 Gaming as well as Hoki Hoshi. I really appreciate all the info and I appreciate that Hoki took time out of his personal life and time to record some footage just for me. It means a lot to have such a great community of people to help when needed. I really hope you guys enjoyed the video and I really hope all of this information comes to fruition. Please remember to leave the video a like, leave a positive comment for me down below and if you're new to my channel, please be sure to subscribe for more weekly content like this. As always, I have been Connor Speed 6. Until next time, much love everyone. See you soon.